but then he shoved his hips forward, didn't he? And our prime mover, which was the leg that was pushing his hip backwards, just become crap, didn't it? That one that was shoving his hip backwards, just then started to go like that, didn't it? So, our game to him, our physiology of ripping that down, shoving that away, and working with you, oh, rubbish, yeah? So we were now, Rob, so we just going to have a right? So look, the idea is even. And then I'm going to, I like the Latin word that he used, displace. It's a good word. We're going to displace his, his, his base, his balance. Because by doing that, it's going to be very, very hard for him to keep doing these moves, these deadlifts, these strong positions, because I want to get rid of his base. So we can't do this, or squat. It can often depend on how he's stood, but the idea is always going to be the same. Don't change how you're doing. Don't change anything. And all the while, I'm going to be doing all the procedures as we do, all the time. All the time, regardless of what he does. I don't want to be looking for this, but I need to be shutting that door and locking it every time it happens. So I need to be moving the hips as necessary and hanging off it, blah, blah. Okay? Look at this opportunity here I've got. We're in position here. As soon as I feel I've set position. So the second I am in this position, a light needs to go off in your head. I've got his hip. I've got his arm. I've got his neck. I've got his arm there. I'm in position. I need to evolve. We can't stay here all day. It's not defensive. This is the thing, as you start to learn this today, I want you to realise you've got to be attacking and aggressive. Hopefully you get it done in three seconds and you've had a turnover or tapping. But I've got to be moving on all the time to make it worse and worse and worse. Now in this position, we know that it's not sufficient because even though I've got him, and whatever he does, I can counter it. He might do that arse drop and that deadlift that we've just done. So what can I do to counter that? I'll do me hang. Look, I like to go this side so I do it this way. I'll do this me hang this way. And he's not going to hit me with a helmet pass because before he can do anything, I'll open his knee, don't push it back, open it, and then push it away. I'll just get rid of his base. Yeah. But once you're in this position, if you wanted to, you could go back. Is that a bit? That makes sense. So the second I feel him start, well, I want to do it before. But he can prove a point to himself that if he drops his bum to try and do that move, feel this. Get rid of his base, put your foot out of it so you have a point there. Look. Now, if you know any moves at all, well, you've got the triangle here, you've got the closed guard with your arm across there, you've got hooks in there for some radiation, you've got strangles. Do you understand? His base is not there. Do you understand? Because I do the reefs as well, so you can see. And like I'm saying, we need to move into this efficiently and with haste. So I'm trying to just cripple this physiology. I have got the grips. If I'm standing like this, and I'm standing like that, I'm just trying to do throw a medium. And all I can do is defend, but it's no different on the ground. If I'm holding my knee, and he isn't, it's true. But his neck, not on the left, but he's just like that. So here we are in a position. No, it's good. I'm playing well. I want to display spot. So look, I open it, push it back. Can you see how I'm hanging? Look, I can sit up and hang if I want. So he's got the hanging thing on. But my game was always, always, always back. But it's all there. This might happen. Look at me, knee. Look at me, knee. See that? Do you want one of these guys? Look at this. One of those guys. You've got people in there. I just manipulate. Look, you've got your tracks. Sorry. Look, your triangles. Your closed guard on your side. And you see, look at the arm. That make any sense? Yeah? So now you need to look at that. So look, you control him perfectly well. You want more. Take away one side of the base. Displace it. And just have a look at that. Do that move, and then in a minute we'll start looking at what we can do with 